What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into Halle Bailey fans upset with DDG video with Halo. Let's get it. Chris Sales responded to Queen Naja's recent <laughs> interview speaking on him. I remember I wasn't able to wear uh, a bathing suit in my last relationship. A bathing suit? I didn't care if Shorty wore a bathing suit. No offense, but she was insecure in the bitch anyways. That's why she went and got a BBL. She was insecure. I'm not going to lie. Trolling, like, trolling is trolling, but he's just bitter. He's bitter at this point. He's bitter. He's bitter. Um, Holding her down, wiping her makeup off her face is crazy. And also, what, what was what she said? Oh, security. Bathing suit. Him. I remember yeah, I wasn't not being able, able to, wear to wear a bathing suit means he was insecure because who can't wear a bathing suit? Huh? Not like he was pretty insecure to me. <laughs> Her bathing suit, no offense, but she was insecure in the bitch anyways. That's why she went and got a BBL. She was insecure. I'm just being real. I want to tell y'all the truth because I'm tired of my name getting bashed on my soul. What the fuck is you talking about? I'm tired of my name getting bashed. Every time I see an interview about me, it's always bad things. Well, if it was so bad, why did you stay with me for six years if everything was just bad? Every time you break up with somebody, the females always tend to, this did this, this did this, but she will never say anything good that he did. He wouldn't, she would never glorify that man. They would never be like, oh yeah, he was a good person. He did this, he made sure I was straight. He did this, he dropped out of college for me. He did this. So I absolutely don't disagree with this part um, because that shit real. <laughs> but um, <laughs> you can't just be out here wiping makeup off a woman's face or to tell me I can't wear a bathing suit is just top tier crazy. I, I don't. Like Dwayne said, don't shake your ass on live. A completely reasonable ask. Would you want me to go to the pool with a sweatsuit on or? <laughs> this, he did this, he did this. He made sure my family was straight when they was on section eight. He did this, he did this. He bought me flowers. He made sure I was straight. He loved me. Like there is never that. It's like the bad always outweighs the good when you get out of a relationship, but I'm just sick of tired of and, 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 and honest to God, they was tagging me in that video. That's the only reason why I'm reacting to this. I'm just irritated right now. I'm not even, it's not even messy Chris right now. I'm just irritated. <laughs> Cardi B was put on blast after she released her maternity pictures publicly. People noticed that it had pastel spray paint in the background. People thought she was throwing shade at Nicki Minaj because of her husband, Kenna. Cardi B said, first of all, we literally had to pick a random street because paparazzi was hounding us everywhere. This was supposed to be my original first picture and we had to edit the photos in minutes because the shoot got leaked. Didn't even have time to go over every detail because people were busy trying to expose my pregnancy as an aha moment. Second, I'm always with the shits, but I'm not using my maternity shoot to be funny. Are you dumb? No. Why was she? Take a picture in front of a thing that says pedophile. What? Why would she do that? Shade to Cardi B. I love Cardi B. But at no point while you was taking a picture, even if you didn't see the background, your team who's standing by watching you take this picture did not see the background. And even if you edit these pictures within minutes, you had people that are not even professionals that saw the word within seconds on your post. And then to make matters worse, TMZ posts these pictures August 1st. So you had a whole month because you posted September 1st to see the background and see that the word is actually screaming out to you at no point nobody said something is not right here taking a picture in front of something that say pedophile is crazy as much as i want to make sense of this it just doesn't make sense yesterday i reported that corey's dad was arrested for dv and someone close to the family post about it well here's what corey had to say we talking about arvin right see arvin took my dad to jail and they want to be racist up there that's why i keep telling him i don't fuck with arvin he out though he just called me laughing his life he said see they he said, yeah, boy, they took me, they took me to jail just some racist people. 
He said, but it's so crazy, man, how people in your hometown, you never know who hate on you. See, this bitch gonna tag me, right? This bitch tag me from Alabama. I think she's staying in Midway, Alabama, y'all. Go, go search it up for me real quick. I think Midway worse than you in Springs, to be exact. But you know what I'm saying? When your hometown, there will always be people, man, we're trying to bring you down. The bitch gonna tag me. They gonna say, Corey Prince, do what you get her from. See, my dad went to jail. My dad didn't even do that. I just got to find my dad. And I understand how racist Auburn is. But I ain't like how she tagged me, man, and try to, try to put my... So, wait. So, he, he didn't... He didn't hit him. Okay. Hey, man, trying to make it seem like I, you know what I'm saying? Like I got something to do with that. I was just trying to put me in my dad's image. But you know, where she at, she, 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 she ain't got nowhere to go in her life. You feel me? She'll never live like this. You know what I'm saying? Like, she live in Midway, Alabama, you know? And uh, it, it, it ain't, it only got one gas station out there. And it barely a gas station. You know what I'm saying? But, um, yeah, you feel me? She, she thinks she cute and shit. She probably, she probably just um trying to get some little clout to try to come live like this or some shit like this. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if it's gonna happen, but you look at the shit, I laugh at it. I just laugh at it. I just, you know what I'm saying? These folks crazy as hell, man. But anyways. Halle Billy fans are upset with DDG because they feel like he's rushing Halo to be a big kid too fast. Recently I think it's just kind of crazy when it comes to domestic violence. It's always a uh, it didn't happen situation. But we can't act like it don't happen. So... I don't know. I guess Corey just gonna take that to the grave. Halo fell asleep on stream and DDG put him in a bean bag, which people said it was unsafe. Then people were upset that DDG put Halo in a ball pit. First of all, I don't tell people what to do with their kids because this is his kid. But Halo is a very advanced kid and he's <sighs> also a boy. This is all a part of his nah, growing. DDG. <laughs> him dropping him in that ball pit. <laughs> a very advanced kid and he's. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, that kind of alarmed him. <laughs> DDG, why would you drop him in that ball pit? <laughs> he didn't place him in the ball pit. He just dropped him. Also, a book kiss, because this is his kid. But Halo, Girl, is a Halo very was pissed. Kid. Like, oh, oh, shit. Nigga, that's my neck. <laughs> hey, what's wrong with you? <laughs> kid and he's also a boy this is all a part of his growing and his oh development he's setting the foundation doing these activities early actually helps strengthen the early development of a kid talk about the people i can't disagree with that though definitely can't disagree with that's that. actually a problem not you gotta use the muscles cut the cameras dead at Jalen recently sold out his lip glosses despite people trying to cancel him for his recent videos, but people noticed that he only had 60 lip glosses in stock. You sold different lip glosses with only 60 tubes in stock. Got on TikTok <laughs> and said, sold down in 30 minutes. You better be sold out. These are followers. Is. Only put 60 in the cart and then gonna be flexing that you sold out. <laughs> that don't even make sense, Jalen. And I know Carter be looking at your ass dumb. That's why when you be posting this silly shit, he barely be anywhere to be found. I wouldn't want to be caught in the back of that either. Here's what Jalen had to say about people laughing at him for selling 60 lip glosses. Oh yeah, I made a statement too because you know people was like, y'all only put 60 in stock. You seen that comment or seen people talking about that? Uh-huh. And I had to let them know. It's Girl, okay. don't give a damn. That car don't give a damn. It only takes 60 a day to make 50K a month. Okay. So that could never be a read, boo. Do okay. your, you gotta ignore people because sometimes the math don't be math. And... It don't. It really don't. Like, I had to let them know, like, that's all we have to sell a day to make 50K a month. <laughs> Like, y'all gonna do y'all math for real. Like, y'all gonna make a thing Before you mumbling castle, okay? You got math. When I roll up the Wendy's, I'm gonna need me a four for four with the large strawberry lemonade. Thank you. You got my orders of cookies and cream too, right? Y'all yeah. you cookies and cream? Um, yeah, after this. Okay. <laughs> Ladies, what happened? Did you like one cookies and cream? She just checked them on her cookies and cream mm -hmm. for no reason. <laughs> yeah. What yeah, happened? Bro, what is wrong with you, gang? <laughs> <laughs> bro. Just drunk as heck. You got my orders of cookies and cream too, right? Did you like your cookies and cream? Um, yeah, after this. Okay. Ladies, <laughs> <laughs> did you like one cookies and cream? Drunk as hell. Oh, <laughs> 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 Yeah, bro, what is wrong with you, bro? <laughs> <laughs> bro, Queen is drunk. I'm pissed. I'm pissed.
she able to get drunk and have cookies and cream at the same time. You know, some things in life are just not fair. Do you know I can't have either one of them motherfuckers? I'm going to tell you right now, Ed, life would be better if I could just choose one and not fucking die from both. No, Now, have I had a lot of cookies and cream in my life? Yes. Yes, I have. Have I drank from the bottle like it was nothing? And that's probably why I'm in this situation anyway. Mm -hmm. Yep, 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 yep. And that's the problem. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Shorty is drunk. Shorty said, Are you, do you have my cookies and cream? He said, yeah, you want it right now? He said, no, after. Like, he would have did that anyway. No, I just didn't know if he got my order of it. <laughs> More ice cream? <laughs> oh, these are the cookies right here. Oh, shit. <clears throat> y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, y'all.